سیاست در قبال ایران of the National Council of Resistance of Iran, Mrs. Rajvi has literally devoted her life to the cause of helping the people of Iran to achieve the freedom and democracy which they want and are going to get. And in large measure, that will be because of Mrs. Rajvi. Mrs. Rajvi. Mr. President, Lord Corbett, ladies and gentlemen, I salute your gathering. I would like to first express my gratitude to the British Parliamentary Committee for Iran Freedom and the International Parliamentary Campaign in Defense of Ashraf for initiating this conference. I would like to also commend members of the House of Commons for the valuable early day motion emphasizing the importance to safeguard Ashraf security and also the need to delist the PMOI from the U.S. list of terrorist organizations. Dear friends, three days ago the Egyptian people's uprising succeeded the dictatorship ruling that country fell. Before that, Tunisian people's uprising triumphed. We know that people in other parts of the region are also protesting. In fact, the spring of freedom has arrived in the Middle East. People are demanding democracy everywhere. Young people and women are the active forces of this movement. 